I was giving a seminar, I think it was over in Oxford, and sort of briefly mentioned some of these these patterns. And there was a very good friend of mine, Nick Proudfoot, came up afterwards. He said, well, that's interesting, a bit like fingerprints, aren't they? And that's it. <laughs> Let's call them DNA fingerprints. And that actually was a very wise thing to do. If we had called these, say, individually discriminating southern blots, mini, sat mini satellite hybridization profiles, um, I, I mean, we would have killed the technology. Absolutely stone dead. You know, never got off the starting block. But by calling it DNA fingerprints, it, it, the public, and we did get quite a lot of press coverage on this, the public sort of. They, they, they could twig what we're trying to say. 